we are back at it again. Got a little bit of an evening shave this time. Uh, it's probably around like 5 o'clock or so. So I uh, just wanted to get to this uh, beautiful shave, nice soap that came in today. So uh, you guys know what we're talking about. So it's going to be very interesting. Uh, love the scents that are coming off it already. But we'll delve into that in just a moment. Uh, as always, we're going to get to the tools of the trade, which are fantastic. So uh, tonight's shave or this evening shave, we are going to utilize... The Gillette Monotech, also known as the Brazilian Aristocrat. This is a 1950-ish. Um, one of the codes was missing, so they couldn't really dial in exactly uh, to when this was produced. Um, and here I do have the Balzano blade. You guys are you guys probably sick of seeing these things, but uh, but I do love them. Uh, this is a fantastic piece, just a, a wonderful little rare vintage uh, Gillette. I, I absolutely love this guy. It's a, it's a banger of a shaver, so it does a fantastic job. Again, another Razor Emporium revamp. Kudos to you guys. You're, you're spectacular. So here's this little beauty, this little peach. We'll give it that nice quarter lock up there. You do get the bit of the blade, as always, on these kind of the monotechs and super speeds, but uh, nothing of uh, concern whatsoever. It, at least it's never been to me, and I hope never to you. Uh, so you shouldn't feel anything off of that at all. So, and again, those were the Balzanos, and these are uh, the ones from Egypt. The Egypt ones are the ones I recommend wholeheartedly. Uh, the Germany ones, just, you know, no, no bueno, no good. Okay, so that's that. For the brush, I haven't used this guy in a while, and it's, it's fantastic, you know, so it is a, a hell of a good uh, brush. This is the custom one that I had done, uh, and this is from Symmetry Turning. And you can find them over on Etsy. It's Mark Simon. He does a great job. This is so nice. Uh, so this is the Mandalorian. I, this thing is just, look at that. It's so, this soap seems a little bit denser. So I figured we'd give it a real nice silver tip badger. This guy is fantastic. So bowl, vermel bowl, down in the pit, warming up. Uh, you guys know I love that. So let's get to sh shave uh, the soap of the day. Of the day. So here we go. Cooper and French. Fantastic company. Uh, you guys may have heard of them. They've been around for a bit. Uh, based out of Minneapolis. It's a husband and wife team. Rich and Stephanie, I believe, are the owners. Um, uh, Rich was kind enough to send me an email uh, or we, through Instagram. We kind of just chit-chatted just slightly. Uh, I don't know them. I purchased this direct. and It was actually after I purchased it that I just kind of gave them a heads up that I really liked what they had going on. Uh, this one is $21.99. It's five ounces and it's a tallow base. You got shea butter in here. So, so those two right off the bat are going to really uh, give us a nice glide and nice, nice feel. Oh, it's a beautiful scent. It really is a lovely scent. I hope you're picking up that puck there. It's, it's nice. Uh, it's got a creamy texture. It's dense. So, it, it, you know, you got to get yourself a puck here, but it's got a creamy feel to it. So as soon as you start kind of gliding on it, um, I already have some remnants on my fingers just from that scent profile. Oh boy, it's it's um, it really is quite lovely, and and literally I got this in today, and and that's why I wanted to do the evening shave because I was just like this is just perfect timing. I need it, and it just smells great. So uh, that said, I get a little bit of like a honey and caramel type of thing happening there, just ever so slightly, uh, a bit of citrus. Oh man, and then uh, some nice spice and it just kind of, just a little bit of floral coming in at the end. So uh, so that's, that's quite complex. It's a, so it's a really nice, well-rounded, uh, you know, little, uh, oh, little scent uh, buffet, <laughs> so, so to say. So really quite lovely. So we'll get to that. Let me wet the face because you can smell that all day long, but let, let's get to it. So I'm going to get some of this into the bowl. I'm going to do like usual. I'm going to hit some into the bowl and then some on the face. We'll build it up, you know, here and there. So, but uh, really very lovely. Uh, the, the scent profile, very nice. I like that. Not just one thing coming at you. You know, it gives you a nice kind of little escalating sense. So I dig that. And we're going to drop this in here and get this into this nice Beau Brumel bowl, as we always do. I can't get away from this bowl. It's just too fantastic. I wish there were more marble bowls out there. I, I try to find them. It's the only one I really can find. Um, I, I'm telling you, if you haven't tried 
a marble bowl, that heat retention, uh, it, it'll make you a believer. Or it's just me. Okay, so you can see. So there it is, picks that up nicely in there. So that's what we're working with today. And that should be absolutely plenty. Let me get the rest in the brush. Okay. I do not like to waste any. We'll get this in here. And I'm sure this guy's going to want some decent water. So, all right, enough jib jabbing. Water to the face. All right. And uh, and very nice the way they, they sent everything over. They sent over, uh, you know, I don't want to show any address or anything like that, but they sent over a nice little, you know, it's the receipt, but, but nice handwritten note saying thank you for purchasing the product and, um, you know, you guys know I love all that stuff. And there's a little card and a little thing about the business. So uh, seems seem like a really nice, really nice people, nice company. I, I love, you know, small business artisans, you know, making their products and getting them out to us to enjoy. So let's work this guy up. Wow. Uh, just so you can see, it's uh, it's running. Oh man, that's a really nice fresh scent. Man, great job on the scent profile. I do love it. And it really just kind of comes at you in waves. It's very, very nice. It's not one particular thing that just, you know, coming at you and you're like, oh, okay, yeah, I, I pick up spice. Um, no, no, it's very, very nice. So, I mean, I've, I've been on this for two seconds. I didn't even get to the face yet. All right. Well, I mean, Tallow and Shea, you know, usually those two were uh, those two were a good combination. Let's see how we do. It's a very, very lovely scent. Very lovely. Oh wow! Yeah, that's that's <laughs> slinging some soap. Some soap. Let's build this up. Wow. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm okay, yeah, that's really uh I mean I'm not done yet, but it's very nice. Oh, this brush is incredible. I mean it really is. This brush is so nice. It has such a wonderful feel to it. Nice amount of backbone and great comfort. I mean, so, so soft and, and just wonderful. Wow, there you go. So, not going to need that bowl anymore. So, there you have it. So, once this thing got cranking, and it didn't take too much soap at all, to be honest. I mean, water. Too much water at all. So, and there you have it. Oh, man. So, this is, this is really, really nice. It's got a wonderful texture to it, which I'm not surprised at at all, you know, being that the properties that it has built into it, um, they did a wonderful job on the scent profile and a uh, whole, I mean, look at what's on my hands. <laughs> I usually save the, the soap shot for, shot for the end, but uh, holy mackerel, it is literally slinging it. Fantastic. Wow, really, really nice job. All right, let's get to the shape because, you know, it, it is, it's a wonderful texture. It's very, very, uh, really, really nice. So paint your brush and we'll go. Mmm. And the, uh, oh, man, look at that. Oh. The, uh, the scent. One second. Sorry about the water. Uh, the scent's very nice. It's not blowing out. Uh, you know, it's it's picked up very nice after the lather, um, but not not overpowering in any sense. In any scent, <laughs> in any sense. Let's have at it. Let's go, Monotech. And this, and the Balsano, Balsano. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. See, there, that's very, very nice. It's completely cleaned up. Again, you know, 
these Gillettes, the, the Balzano blades, and I get a nice, I get nice residual slickness here. So very, very comfortable. I can do my cleanups and whatever I need to do uh, will not be an issue. So uh, kudos there as well. So you got a nice scent profile. You got wonderful density and texture. Look at that. And then you've got some cool residual slickness there as well. So uh, that is what I would call a good shave and a good soap. Great um, feedback on that. I mean, sorry if you can't hear that, but yeah, very nice. Very nice indeed. Yeah, it's a peach. Yeah, I really had a good couple of days sitting on here. So this was very well needed. I usually like my morning shaves, but hey, you know, when the shaves are calling, I'm showing up. Oh, this little monotech. I saw this thing show up on their site. I, I, I jumped all over it. And I actually have number five coming from them. Not a monotech, something else. But another vintage. I know. It's becoming a problem. A good problem. All right. I gotta say, I love the way this went. All right, let me clean up. Let's do final thoughts. Let's get that soap shot. Stand by. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Wow. What a wonderful little soap. I mean, seriously, a yeah, little soap, like it's a tiny little thing. $21.99, shipping was included, five ounces, fantastic. Ah, it's wonderful. That's a scent that you want to carry with you for, for the next couple of hours, without a doubt. If that spends with the night with me, I love it. You know what I mean? Good to go. All right, soap shot. Just so you know, I mean, this thing really blew out, and you can see there's still some soap in the bottom of that bowl. So imagine where that would have gone. All right, and... Here we go. Oh, my word. So, <laughs> I, I love these soaps nowadays. Uh, I mean, look. So, this is, uh, this is really, really nice. There you go. Look at that shot. I mean, yo, that is some nice texture. Really, really nice. Ah, it's a beautiful scent. Just very fresh, effervescent. And just a, a, just a wonderful bouquet of different scents coming at you. Great job. Oh, that's wonderful. So there you have it, folks. I think I covered everything you need to. Sorry about the water. I think I covered everything you need to know about that. So Cooper and French, nice job, guys. It's the first time I've used their product, and uh, it will not be the last. That is for sure. They were also kind enough, just so you know, send along a little sample. So this is a uh, relentless, yeah, relentless. Uh, this is another one that they have in stock, but very nice. I didn't want to smell it prior, I mean, before doing this shave because I like to keep my nose just to what, I'm, what I need to smell for the shave. That's nice. Maybe we'll do a review of that guy. So there you have it, guys. Hope you enjoy the shave. Take care. Catch you on the next one. Be good.